Bro, no, it didn't work. I'm looking at my ship. I can't fast travel to it. F-wording liar. I want to go to the unknown right there. Structure. Structure. 845 meters away. Yo, Shish Kebab, did you go to this uh, location? Did you go to these locations before leaving? Were you a proper gamer? Or did you let the game tell you what to do? I don't take orders from a video game. That's why I'm asking. I just want to see what kind of gamer you are. Be kind. Graze these nuts, am I right? My mission now is to make money. I like that energy, man. Don't attack me. I have a shotgun and it's very efficient. Why? All right, bro. No, no, you wanted this. Yak. Yak. Damn. All right, Widowmaker. There's another area. So, hey, pineapple. These areas are like more than almost a kilometer away. I can't board my ship and then re-land over here because it's not no man's sky. Don't tell me what it is, but later on, do I unlock a better form of uh, transit that I can use to traverse areas like this in shorter distances or in uh, faster speeds, I should say? No, I just got to walk I have to walk a kilometer to get to my destination like a tourist. That's a five minute walk. Relax. I will not relax. And the reason why I won't is because I'm being extremely hypocritical right now. In the sense that like I was like man you know what you can't actually traverse from space to the planet like a no man's sky but I'm sure there are better ways to explore and the game's like yeah you can land on the planet and fucking walk around and not use transit and I'm like but I don't wanna that's not what I meant pat 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 upon pat upon pat upon pat 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 pat, pat upon Whoa, what was that? Oh, protection and regeneration. Nice. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I found zero flora so far. Barrett gave you a nice Fitbit, but in those steps, true, he gave me a ship too. I'm using one of the two. Ooh. New tech. Yes, event. Not the logistic delivery game having better landscape traversal SMH. Shoutouts to uh, Death Stranding, wherever you are right now. Death Stranding 2 is still a thing we get in the future. How colossal is that? Things to look forward to for 400, Alex. I guess we're trading nowhere mass for Noricio. I'll take it. Good morning, Nerecio. Good night, Sam. I'm just playing. You two are equals. Also just playing. No, you're not. Oh, a cave? What's up, Raz Space? The creator is making a new game. The creator of Patapon is making a new game. I did not see that. 
Is it going to be on the play date? Because I would be down for that. I love how my first instinct is to approach a structure with my shotgun equipped. Are those... Is that gunfire? Pipeline substation. What if I approach with my gun not out the entire time? Wait, I'm not a threat. Hello, I'm unarmed. Hello. I'm just looking to show up. Maybe take some belongings. I don't know. IDK. I'm unarmed. Hello. Hello. How are you? What's happening here? Just curious. I saw some gunfire. That is a level 10 <gasps> Terramorph. That's the thing that killed everybody. Oh no, it's rat scorpions all over again. It's a fucking giant rat scorpion. All right, whoever had the, uh, oh, oh, oh. What if? No, no, no. It was jokes. It was jokes. You can jump? No way! Why? Why? Where'd you go? What is this? It's like a horror film. Where'd you go? Why do you shake the earth when you yell? Shit! No, 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 no! I do. Wait, I have an idea. Where's my Granada? Ming, 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 ming. I have a knife. What do you mean, clang? Shoddy. Stop. It hurts, don't it? I got you, buddy. Don't worry. I'll avenge you. Do not. I have 49 bullets left. Oh, I'm losing health from the screams. Ha 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 ha. It's morphin time. Chill. Just chill. Oh my God. Nope. You are not even a half health yet. Bro, how are you still alive?
Like, how are you still alive, brother? Don't do that. Ming, 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 ming. Ming, 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 ming. Oh, that shit hurt, didn't it? You see, he's not a machine. He's a man. Don't run, B word. Oh, good dodge. Reloading. Reload. Stop it. Stop, 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 stop. Don't hide. You wanted this. Well, you didn't want this, actually. I started this. I'm going to finish it, too. What's good, B word? Watch my back. Don't turn around ever again. Stop using my own tactics against me. All right, bro, chill. Enough of this. Shit. I have an idea. I have a bad idea. I have a better idea. Um. Yes, obviously. Give me that. And also, uh. Aid. Yes. Take the hell out of that for sure. A little bit of that too. All right, B word. New and improved me. Huh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. I'm done attacking you. Just kidding. Bro. I feel bad. It's like it's hiding from me. Because I'm the predator now. I'm out of all my ammo almost. Shoddy for the body. Knock, knock. Open up the door. It's me with the nonstop pop pop and the stainless me. Yak, yak. Call that the yak yak. One more, one more? Yak yak. 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 Mink. Oh, yeah. Right in the face. Our Minka. Easy money. Easiest fight of my life. I'm him. Oh, hey. Homie, you good? Remember the notes you read on the computer from the scientists? Yeah. You're basically saying I'm the equivalent of like an entire squad of red devils. Who needs UC Marines or red devils when I've got me? Oh, oh my God. Can be consumed to greatly increase 500. Oh my God, worth it. The Terra Morph? Yeah, I, that's what I said at the beginning of the battle. That's what I opened up with. That was literally the first thing that I said, Krat. Can I? I don't know why I decided to read that. I almost read it to completion. Would have been a mistake. I was playing my game and wasn't listening. Nigga, that's not my fault. Pay attention or shut up. I'm out here like, man, my spade suit's gray. And Krat's like, oh, Adrian, by the way, remember uh, when you opened the game up? Yeah. 
And your suit was gray? Yeah, it's gray. All right. Next off. Chrono would never. All I'm saying. What's weighing the most? A couple of spade suits. I will give you my tunnel mining pack and my space suit. Sorry that I let you die. We should be free of carrying objects. I still organize it by thank Lord. Hopefully we meet again over and over again and you don't dip on me and just like keep my stuff. The RPG special. When you fully equip someone and they just dip on you and you never see them again until like five hours later in the game. And they're like, oh, hey, where you been? How have you been? I'm glad you're still alive. And I'm like, yeah, where's my stuff? And they're like, what stuff? Smiley face. That's the eBay listing smile. Oh, yeah, I should know better. It's one of those games, right? The value is 1300. I go to a trader. They're like, ah, yes, I will give you 350 for it. And I go, ah, yes. I need the bar, excuse me, the barter skill. Well, Chrono, if you can, hopefully watching my gameplay gives you a bit of insight of the level of skill you need to do it and that you can do it too. You're a talented gamer, so I feel like you have no problem with it. I can't believe these bozos lost. Like, how did you all lose that thing? Couldn't be me. Proof is right there. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Duh. No, don't stand there. I don't know what time it is. Standard pose category. Can I change that? Not yet. Oh, I like that. It looks like I'm standing on him. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, I like that. No textures. This would be a good photo. I can't tell where his head begins. Oh, his head's right there. Perfect. That actually looks like a sci fi comic. That's so dope. Ha! What a perfect screenshot. This is such a video game. That is so cool. Look at that. Yo. Oh. I'm so overjoyed. Gaming 101. You are cleared for landing. Maybe I spent too much ammo on that. I don't know. Hard to say. Jesus, dude. Clang much? Uh, Canuck double double. Look at that. Pro gamer. That is me. First name and last name. How can I help you? You know what I am, Tommy? You know, in the 1990s. When people didn't have access to magazines, right? And the internet was just not even in its infancy yet. It was something that wasn't available to the general public yet, right? Let me tell you something. If you needed tips on how to beat a game, you know what you do? You'd call a hotline. You'd call a hotline. Like, hello, hey, what's up? Um, So I'm playing Mario 2 right now and the mouser is kind of kicking my ass. 
so I just need some help on how to get past that. And you'd pay a, a monetary amount per minute spent, you know, an introductory price for the first minute and then several minutes after that for the tips they would give you. That's me. I'm that hotline. When Drake mentioned the hotline bling, he was talking about me. I'm the one you call up like, hello, Adrian hotline. Hey, Adrian, what's up, man? I'm playing Starfield right now. And uh, this Terramorph is like level 10. I'm level two and I just don't know what to do. Should I come back later? Come back later? Like a bitch? No. Stand your ground and fight it. But I don't know how to beat it. I'm not a pro gamer like you. All right, here's what you're going to do. You have the shotgun? Yes. All right. So duck and cover. Blip, blop, 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 blop. And I hope that helps. Thank you so much, Adrian. No problem. That'll be $17. Okay, let me get the credit card out. It's my mom's. What's your name again? Chrono. No problem, Chrono. Do what you got to do. Hope it helps. Good luck. What frame rate am I getting? I'm running at 60 FPS. I'm doing 60. Uh, 1440p, 60 FPS. Uh, but recording and streaming at 1080p. I don't know. I haven't tried to run it outside. It. Well, I did mostly testing offline for streaming, but I haven't tried running the game independently to see what I would do. So I have a 5900X AMD and a 3070, uh, eight gigs and 32 gig RAM. So I don't know what performance I can do when I have OBS turned off. I also usually run triple monitor setup, but with this setup, I can run dual monitor. So I bet I could run ultra single monitor. Non-streaming. I don't know if I could do dual monitor, ultra setup, non-streaming. Oh. How's this? Guess not. You have a shotgun, you win by default. True. Can I not grab that? It's outline blue. Can I not grab it? On my Leanne rhymes? Blue. Guess not. Hmm. Good night, Spider. Thank you for gifting a sub. May all your days be merry and bright. Well, thank you for being here, I guess. <laughs> More than gifting a sub. Thank you for gifting a sub. Had you not gifted that, who knows what I would have said to you. Got everything over here. The reason why I'm being so... I guess conscientious about what I'm looking at is because I just fought a level 10. And so I may never come back to this area again. I want to make sure I have everything before departing. You know what I mean? No one likes to play the game of, oh, I missed out on this. Now I have to go back there. Unless any of you like doing that. I don't. Navigation is pretty awful in this game, so who knows? Well, you would know because you're playing it. You would know if you'd like to go back to an area to do it again. So, would you? Outside couch, very nice. Got me here, like, feeling like I want to say move it, football head. Nice. Good gate opening sound. High-speed data cables, what? Got that Cat 70. Very nice. Some F-boarding books. Circuit board, I'll get that from Michimoshi. Thought I heard a squeal like a creature. Sounded like prey though, not predator. I just wish to know where it is so I don't accidentally step on it or something. 
Oh, you have to keep scanning those dust roots. That's true. I keep just grabbing them and harvesting without scanning. That's my bad. That's on me. Double sided gates. Nice. Got a bunch of skin over here. Nice. I did that shit. I did that shit. I did that shit. I did that shit. Missing out on some resources, but we'll get back to that later on. For now, let's see what's under the hood. Oh, wait. I think you can fast travel to locations you've been to. Since I technically have been here and destroyed that thing, I can come back here whenever I want to. This is a great No Man's Sky patch. You want to know what the irony is? No Man's Sky recently had a new patch with new content because they periodically do. They have small patches and they have big patches and they just have one of their big patches. And even though I have access to Starfield early on, I'm probably going to play that patch because you know why? No Man's Sky is still a fucking great game. The reason why I said great game like that is because I saw that and my pitch changed because I thought it was another one of those, but it's not. Kiki. I'll take both. I'll take both. I'll take BOFF. So is that it? Is that everything? Oh, can you not kill them, by the way? I got to scan them, I think. So just hold your fire. Don't be a bitch. Beginning combat protocol. No. Okay, now you can die. Run up, get done up. All right, Betty. No, come back. Come on, you want to run it? Come on. You out of breath? Not me. In Turn. combat, there is a high likelihood of human death. Bro, where are you going? Oh, you are out for blood, huh? We Jesus. Bro got the Roadhog ult and just pressed Q and was like, ah, ha, 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 ha. Just because your Q is available doesn't mean you should press Q. There's a tactical implication with your Q. I burned myself out on No Man's Sky a bit a year ago, but it seems they're always adding new stuff. It's still a great game. If you play a lot of it, it's easy to burn yourself out. I think that's true for a lot of games, but I think unlike a lot of games, No Man's Sky is easy to come back to after burning yourself out. So you pour in 180 hours, you take a six month break, come back. You could easily put in another 60 hours right there. I don't think there's a lot of games you could do that with. In Final Fantasy 15, when I beat the main storyline after several thousand hours, I did come back and play each of the episodes without feeling burnt out and Pythios Ruins, which is godlike. In fact, Pythios Ruins might be one of the greatest little secrets in Final Fantasy history. Fucking water? Yo, can I get some H2O in the chat? Guess not. <laughs> Tommy, that's actually genius. Well done. Good joke. 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 I will bow down to a true pimp. I don't know what I thought was going to happen doing that. With gas, Michi Moji with the combo joke. I love my community, man. They're so funny. All because we don't allow puns or low hanging fruit. Good job, team. Probably will end up being the same with this game. Play it to death this year, then come back for DLC. 
Ain't nothing wrong with that. Cornbread, you know what I mean? I feel kind of miffed because these are two locations that were on the scanner to arrive to. And uh, I don't feel... Well, I do feel rewarded because that actually gave me part of the storyline. The Terramorph. Which if you hadn't been reading the PC terminal stuff, you would just wonder what is this level 10 creature, right? But since I've been reading it, it was cool to encounter that thing. So I guess the pipeline substation was a reward for reading the data and also the item you get that it drops. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Not the way that I put it, but yeah. It also gave you drugs. Yeah, it's like a pusher that you murder. Hey, like a pusher. So yeah, it all works out. But I keep my inner gamer just keeps telling me there's something else that should be here. But I guess that's just greedy to expect that. You know what I mean? Everything that was here is what should have been here. Damn, that was so deep for me to say that. Everything that should have been here was here. Damn, Adrian, I'm so deep. So white's what I've gone to, yeah? Okay, cool. Yeah, I can fast travel to any place that I've gone to. That's actually tight as fuck. Because that means I can come back here whenever I want to. And then just fast travel here to walk there. So I don't have to go here right now. I can come back, fast travel here to walk to either of these locations. That's cool. Then fast travel here to go to this location. Then leave, come back, fast travel here to go to there. The only thing out of range is this. Which makes me wonder how important it must be. Thonking. But isn't there a cave here too that was highlighted? I don't see that on the map. Oh. F word in cave. You haven't completed the survey of the moon. Oh, the first location that was on. Did you go back, Chrono? Or did you just never leave? Oh, this location. Oh, bro. I mean. I'm missing one resource and two fauna and two floras. Wait a minute. Son of a B word. I just realized something. Oh, slow down, slow down, tiger. Wait, can I not scan the Terramorph? Nah, they wouldn't. Oh, you can't. It's not indigenous. Technically, they created this thing, right? And the Terramorph was gained from another planet. So I can't scan the Terramorph. Right? Because it wasn't indigenous. They brought it from a different location. And plus, they wouldn't be dicks about that. They would let you scan it after death. They wouldn't say, sorry, you killed it. You can't scan it now. Lamau, get wrecked, nerd. They wouldn't. You went back, got it. Two days in, how are you feeling about this game? I have uh, minimal complaints. None of which warrant observation, I would say. Uh, to put it abruptly, I guess all the good outweighs the bad thus far. Know what I mean? They would? No, 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 no. Shh. Don't put that out in the universe. Don't put that out in the universe. No, 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 no. I have a knife. You know what else I have? I have deep dish pizza. And it's one of those deep dish pizzas that are really good when you first buy them and incredible when you reheat them. 
can't wait to smash that. I love, I mean, typically I'm a big New York slice guy. I like the big long pieces, but this deep dish is built differently. Plus the edges, they kind of burn them a little bit. So you have that crunch. Like, I don't know, am I a weirdo? I'm one of those weirdos that likes the charboiled taste of the charcoal taste. So the edges are slightly burnt crispy. So you crunch into that shit. Mm. Anyway, yeah, the game's dope. Where did you get it from? It's a local place called Jet. It's not from a franchise or branch chain. Not a Domino's, Papa John's, Marco's, Pizza Hut type beat. Speaking of New York based pizza, what's up, Ash? Yo, Ash. Ignoring your affinity for where you reside. Deep dish. Chicago style Detroit, which is the rectangle square style or New York style. Bruno, you cannot answer. And yes, you can have some of my pizza, brother. Of course you can. I got five slices left. You can have uh, you can have one and we'll split another one. You've never had deep dish pizza before? Does Philly have a specialty pizza? Because there's Detroit, New York, Chicago, uh, Kansas City. All have their own special types of pizzas. I cannot ignore my New York City heritage on this. Damn, indoctrinated. It'd be like that, I guess. Shame on me for expecting something different. My bad. Do you? Respect. You just passed a, a Saints Row mission. Respect plus plus. Kansas City, let's go. They have the Philly taco. That's not a pizza though, right? You've never had deep dish? It sounds like you and Mimo got some uh, inequities to fix, yeah? Can I go through here? I guess not. It has pizza. I'll be honest with you. I don't like where this conversation is going. But I will respect it. Oh, come here. I got to scan you. Wait, no, I don't. You 100% scanned. You can fuck right off. So this is just decoration. Nothing's over here. If I want to take a tour on how to pa power a location, I just walk another documentary on Iceland. That's far away. So I did that. I did that. Did I go up there? I don't think I did, because I explored that over and over again. I did that, went back there. Didn't go there yet. That. Decentralized the pizza. Also, good to see you too, Ash. You've been a busy bee lately, too. Hope you're doing well. Ash been out here trying on different fits, taking selfies. Who is she? Kansas City barbecue, though, I guess. That's all y'all talk about is your barbecue. One trick ponies. You take one of Lorenzo's giant slices of pizza and wrap it around a gin cheesesteak. All right, I'm going to stop you right there. That sounds completely unnecessary. That sounds like the episode of the boondock with the Luther. That would be in the same restaurant. I'm sorry we're out of the Luther today, but can I interest you in um, a Philly taco? Maybe. What is it? I'm happy you asked. It's every bit as heart stopping as your favorite. I want to go to that cave, but let me make sure I'm not cool in my last Poe real quick. 
All right, you know what? I'll help the cave and then I'll leave this map. Yeah. Nah, pretzels. I'll be honest with you. I only like soft pretzels and I only like soft pretzels with dipping sauce. Hard pretzels can kick rocks. The only hard pretzels I'll eat are the ones that come in those snack packs where it includes like um, a cheese it Chex Mix, one Cheeto stick, and pretzels. I'll eat those pretzels. Especially if it's in one of the flaming hot containers. Yeah, I'll, but like eating pretzels on purpose in large quantities and without a beverage? I ask you, why? Who would do such a thing? That is terroristic activity. There's a hotline for that. Hello, hotline. Someone's eating pretzels by themselves. Yeah, by themselves. They just eating raw pretzels. All right, stay calm. And just let us know where you are. What was my di favorite dinner during my travel? Um, probably the curry first. Just don't clip me out of context. There's just something different about a soft sausage. You know what I mean? Because like it just throws you off a long, thick sausage, but it's soft. You can just sink your teeth into it. You know what I mean? Not like them stadium joints we get when we go watch baseball. Shit's mad delicious. Mads. I mean, to each their own. <laughs> That's got me fucked up. But yeah, it was really good. What about you, Ash? Where have you been lately that had you smashing some good stuff? What you eating? How about your boy? These are an equal distance from each other from right here. I don't really benefit, but I'm gonna go to the cave because I ain't a bitch. Plus Ash is here. Imagine how impressed Ash would be if he went in this cave and just tore shit up and left. With the old stone cold t-shirt, arrive, raise hell, leave. That's me right now. You found Neon City? Checkmate, atheist. You won't. Level five? Oh, you even look level five. Better fall back, pimp. No ammo. Nah, y'all don't want it. Y'all don't want it. Y'all act like y'all want it. Y'all don't want it. Y'all don't want it. I fuck you up. No, I know. Because you can be a Neon City Street Rat. Oh, Neon City Rat. Neon City... Neon Street Rat. I found the cave! Yeah, I'll be honest with you. I don't like how tiny that entrance is to the cave. Like, it's kind of like a... It reminds me of the episode of Mandalorian in the last season. That kind of cave. A lot of potential to get fucked up. Where are you going? Were you expecting a door? I... Oh. Oh. We're doing oblivion rules. Okay. Yo, look at the shadow of Vasco on the wall. This game don't miss. Hello. Neon. It can't be that easy. What the fuck are these? I 
I have never seen the Mandolin Bounty Hunter show. <laughs> That's a lot of work. You're taking Twafo's jokes now. I think Mandalorian is very entertaining. I found every resource. I'm him. I am. I don't want to say scared. Timid, maybe. I have cause for concern. How about that? Oh God, you scared me with your little rotary noises. Can you put your blender on silence? Is that species roboticist? Is, is that racist? Put your blender on silence? Can you say that? I'll take your carapace, I guess. If this is Final Fantasy XI, I can make a badass armor piece out of your carapace. For those of you who don't know, in Final Fantasy XI at level 45, there's like a uh, crab carapace you can wear. That is really only useful for a few levels for a tank and barely, but it looks super cool. There's an alternate red version too. I think it's actually more useful at this level. No one asked. Shut up, Adrian. Okay, this looks completely unsafe. Okay, shout outs to water. We taking that. Yeah, bro, this is terrifying. What do you think of that glow in the dark analog pocket? I had to really take inventory. As a handheld collector, I wanted it. But I thought long term, would I have it just for a collection's sake? The answer is yes. Do I like it more than my regular white? Yes. Is it worth the money? I thought about it, but the thing is, I already ordered the analog pocket uh, adapters, the cartridge adapters for the Atari Lynx, the TurboGrafx Express, Turbo Express slash PC Engine 2 and uh, Neo Geo Pocket Color adapters, the trio pack. So I figured that's probably enough for now. So I just, I couldn't justify it. But for anybody who doesn't have an analog pocket, yeah, that's that's the one. Hey, these are dead grazers. And a dead trilobite. What would cause such death and destruction? Rise, rise. I think such devastation was someone's intent. Question is, who? Hmm. This cave sure is caving. What the hell's this? A dung pile? Nah, there's an apex predator somewhere in here. Out here is shitting everywhere. Vasco, don't touch that. Leave that to me. to walk at full speed with your pack that full good call i'll give you alpha centauri system i am relieved i'll give you the the butt butt i'll give you the butt stuff that's weighing me down all right you can have all my butt stuff 
Wearing that, wearing that. Um, you can have that. You can't have any of that. You can have that. Have that. <laughs> you can have that. That. I take some of these things. Yeah, I am a klepto. You already killed the apex predator? Does that make me the apex predator then? Do I have to, how many how many times do I have to kill it before I'm the apex predator? Is there like a minimum? Ooh, Mercury. No Freddy. Don't stop me now. I can just grab that shit, right? through there okay, I guess not I have not played Baldur's Gate 3 yet I haven't had Baldur's Gate 3 time and now that I have Baldur's Gate 3 time I prioritize Starfield because reminder this game was given to me via code by the good folks over at Bethesda and Xbox because they love me and I love them so shout outs again to the fine folks over there good looking out thanks for entrusting your boy to showcase a good time to people who want to see this game in action good news you were right I guess that's everything in here. I feel like... Is that truly everything? I guess this is the cave where I can scan shit. Scan the things I missed out on, the things I got in the storage box, and that's it. I was expecting a... almost cataclysmic, like, planet-tilting fight to the death, but... Unless it's one of those things where you enter a location, nothing happens, and then as you're exiting, all hell breaks loose. Because that hasn't happened to me in a game in quite some time. And it is one of my more favorite tropes, to be honest. gonna seem kind of random but ash is so fun i think this is everything that i need where can i go to check my uh progression towards leveling up oh i already leveled up that answers that question oh, i'm guessing it's this right here level three got it okay um hmm Using a boost pack expends less fuel. I can wait on that. Security. You can now attempt to hack expert locks and three auto attempts can be banked. Rings can now turn blue. That's pretty cool, actually. Research methods. Uh, wait on that. Persuasion. 10% chance of success with persuading someone. I haven't even done that part yet. Scavenging, theft. Boxing is amazing. I kind of just want to duff some people for a while. You know what I mean? I kind of want to put hands on people. could bank my points right now. I don't have to spend my points right now, especially if I find out more things that are important to me, like navigation, like combat. Surveying further away sounds dope too. Plus I should look, I should spend more time on these areas and find out what can I explore to later on. So far, I haven't really found myself wishing I was better at something else. 
God, maybe I should have been a politician. Commerce is kind of badass. Oh, intimidation. Interesting. Bribery. Nice. Social is always kind of fun to use. Hmm, should I bank my points? I could be one of those streamers. Remember we used to play, remember when Overwatch was still great and Blizzard, well, wasn't as awful as they are now. And Overwatch was huge. And a lot of times you'd watch the esports streamers who would just be playing match after match. And they'd have like 75,000 loot boxes they never opened up. And you'd watch and be like, Urgh! open your loot boxes. I tried doing that for a bit to be cool. I'm not even gonna lie. I'd play Overwatch and I'd have like 20 open, unopened boxes. Like, oh yeah, I don't open those. I'm just focused on being the best man in the world. I guess it kind of worked because I was the best man in the world. No? I think I'm gonna bank my points. You know what? I might actually unlock this first and then bank my points. Because I know these kind of games from Bethesda, what usually happens is you out of nowhere start encountering expert locks, but not as a transitional change. There's a certain point in the game when all the locks will go from one level to the next, but sometimes they'll throw out the next level of locks early in some locations. That's like, a, oh, if you had invested in this by now, you could take part in this. I won't do it, though. I'm going to bank my points. That entire conversation was just to point out that, ah, I'm not going to spend my points. Good talk, Adrian. Keep forgetting I can fight in third person. For those of you who play this game, how do you play? Do you play in third person or first person? Or do you do over the shoulder Gears of War style like this? Fourth person, grow up. I think I'm done with this planet for now. I think I've explored as much as I want to explore here. And I want to leave and go advance the plot. Everyone rejoices at the news. Wait, who are you? A colonist? Hey, man. Hey. Hello. Hey. Hey. Hi. Oh, sorry, gun. Flashlight. Sorry. Hi. I need to wait for the light to be just right. This might take time. I don't take photos of people. Sorry. What? You live here or... Whoa, what the? Oh, you nearly scared me to death. I never encounter anyone while I'm out here. Yeah, it, it shows. Nice view. All right, pump the bricks. That's the kind of thing Johnny One Lung would say. Nice view. Excuse me? I was referring to the horizon. <laughs> you too. Mostly playing first person in major cities, I'll switch to third person. Ooh, maybe I'll try that. Both majority first person, though. I actually forgot just now, Raspace, that I could switch to third person. I'm so used to using mouse scroll wheel to shift between weapons that I forgot it navigates between first and third person. Honestly, I can't decide if I want to assign that to a different button or not. I do like mouse scroll wheel as a weapon selector. Pistol fingers? Stop it. Good morning. Uh, what are you doing? I'm trying to find photos for a contest, which was either this or another chunks bowl. If you like this place, then you might also like the last place I was at. Map updated. Oh, sick. Thank you. Wait. Please don't stand in the way of my photography. Please step back. 
I need space. Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh Got it? I don't take photos of people. Sorry. Please don't stand in the way. No, I just want to talk to you. Perfection. Can we talk again? I don't take photos of people. Sorry. Please don't stand in the way of my photography. Ah. Map updated. Show me, show me what. Where is this other location? Not that. That's later on. That's later on. If you added something new to my map, then it's not on this planet. Hey, Pineapple. If she just marked the location on my map, how do I find out where it was? Just guess? LOL? G. Yeah, but like this is a location I already had pinged out. These are two locations I have pinged out already. What did she add? Like I knew about this, I knew about this, and I knew about this and this. I knew about all four of these. What did she add? It'd be on the local map. So she lied. Please step back. I need space. I want to talk to her again because there was an option to do trading with her, and I want to see if I can bring that up again to initiate the trade. Where is that trying to take me? Back to my ship? That's the wrong way, though. But I mean, how can I look the gift horse in the mouth if I don't even know what the gift horse is? At least I can be like, here's the gift horse. It's the horse. Thank you. And there's no horse. So it's not even the gift horse. It'd be like you telling me I got you a horse. Great. Where is it? Exactly. I don't take photos. Of Talk to me. In place. I want to trade with you. I don't. Don't I guess it was one time only. I'll go fuck myself. Goodbye. Where'd that pathway go? It's gone now. There was a walking path, and now there's not a walking path. Everything's so difficult. I still can't believe I found a random person out here. That reminds me of Red Dead Redemption. The first one. The second one's too improved. But on the first one, you would just be out in the middle of nowhere and you'd randomly find someone. And it'd be the weirdest thing. Just walking around in the final frontier and being like, oh, hey, uh, random person X. You killed my brother. I challenge you to a duel. Wait, what? <laughs> All right, bet. Does she show up in my scanner? She does as a blue octave. Let's try one more time. Hey. Please step back. All right, good talk. I need space. Let's try the chrono trick. Let's see if it works. I have the utmost faith in Chaboy. I just want to see it in action. Nice. Chrono is so fucking cool. I love that dude. Nice.
Now... Gotta find me some storage containers so I can store all my shit. Galley, use. Oh my god, I can cook! Alien scramble? Bro, for real? A breakfast dish made from alien eggs and diced vegetables? Alright, chill. <laughs> let's just, let's just chill. Alright, man. Like, I shouldn't have ate my cheese. I could have made a grilled cheese sandwich. Ah. Oh. I guess I'll take an alien sandwich, though. That's so badass. I'm finna cook so much. This game is it. This game is it. This game is it. <gasps> Ramen? Five health? All right, whoever made this game is racist. I can't explain why, but that's not, that's not right. That's not conducive to proper planning. Ramen is not five health. The scientist from Alien is like, see, I told you we should have been picking up those eggs. Good reference. Hey, Pineapple. Does the game, the ship here, the Frontier, does it have a storage system? Yes or no? Yes, it does. Interesting. Is it on the inside or the outside? <laughs> okay, all right, never mind. There we go. <laughs> I was trying to play the hot or cold game. Is it this or is it that? What about the, is it this or that? Johnny's like, hey, besides your chair on the left as you're looking out. <laughs> no, it's, it's fine. It's fine. I like your, uh, your enthusiasm. Besides, it didn't help. Captain's Locker, the learned astronomer. Give me that shit. <laughs> Bro, it's okay. I'm not even worried about it. Can I use the Captain's Locker? Can I just transfer shit inside of there? Above? Behind you, above. Oh, the cargo hold. Oh, oh my God. I have a lot of stuff in the cargo hold. Oh, that's smart. They're actually putting it organized. They're putting, okay, that's actually smart. I should do that. Oh, I should do the same thing. Shit. All my resources in there. Yeah. Store our resources. Gang, there's a button to press. Oh man, video games. Video games. So I have a cargo hold and I have the uh, captain's locker. Yeah, because it's such a good, it's a, it's a good QOL, Johnny, right? It's the kind of thing where when you see it, it makes the most sense and you go, ah, yes, thank you for allowing that to happen. But at the same time, duh, like shouldn't we? You know what I mean? Flashy leatherware is hilarious because it is flashy. I'm not wearing a chunks cap. It's ridiculous. Nice. The sell all junk button. That is arguably the best button you can press in any video game. Actually, I would say the best feature in a video game is when you find the sell all junk button and only if you find it after let's say five hours ten hours of gameplay when you're just now starting to hit that cap of like i need money for the first five or ten hours money is okay you can get by but the tenth hour you're like man i don't have as much money as i used to and things aren't selling the same way and you find the section for junk and go oh i can sell all junk and you press it instant rich
It's the best. Must throw all these books too. Carries books on them. Like a buster. Um, this. I only have these really so I can sell them later. <laughs> Until I just realize they're probably not worth a lot of money. It makes a noise every time. That's funny. I'll keep it on me then. Baby girl, put it on me. Nerd. Please, Cronone. Not the toilet again. I don't want another swirly. Much lighter on my feet now. So I keep like all nine of my fucking guns. I can find a firing range. Well, I guess the planet's my firing range. Look at that. I'm a true American. The planet's my firing range. Which gun works the best? I don't know. I'll just go outside and start shooting shit. That should work, right? Let's do it. A good feeling, Johnny. Second only to having a companion who's like, oh yeah, you can put your stuff on me. And you're like, you know what? Thank goodness, because I don't need eight guns of the same type, but I do want to sell all eight. So it's your job to hold on to all eight. God, space is so fucking cool. Can I get a caster command for space? Oh yeah, they told me how to do this. Go to missions. There, set course. Oh, activities. Oh! I think I did that by accident. I'll do that later. Let's do it. Is the is the ship okay? What are you what is it what is it doing? Why is it do chill? Oh Jesus, I'm so dumb. I was sitting here like, why am I not moving? I looked down my my thing and I was like, no grav, Adrian. Yeah. Oh man, just like No Man's Sky, they're scanning my shit. Starship Frontier, this is United Colony Security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Okay. Scan complete. No contraband detected. But you know it. Yeah, no contraband. <laughs> Colon XD. <laughs> Old head ass. Oh, great. Well, how kind of you. Welcome to OK. New Earth. Atlantis. Finally, we're ahead of there. It's about time. I've been meaning to do this. What up, Luke's? What up, Shelves? Look at all that water. I just got water too from the other planet and felt like a G. This planet is like, oh, you got water? That's cute. We got that too. Respect. Hello, Raiders. You can also third person the ship. Ooh. Okay. I'll land my ship. What up, Shelbs? Fellow Star Explorer, are you on this too? 
You struck me as a Baldur's Gate 3 type player. Did you abandon that to play this or you never got started on it? Either way, I'm just now landing in New Atlantis because I can't stop touching everything. I can't stop exploring everything. You know what I mean? Like I have this addiction to walk around and examine everything in open world games like this. I don't want to go as far as to say it's toxic. It might be. I don't know. But I recognize it. Word choices, though? What'd I say? I might go back to BG3 and I'm playing it offline for now. I'm trying to get better at that myself. Recognizing there are games that I can just play offline, you know what I mean? Not everything has to be streamed. What do you think so far? I love this game. I think so far I've put in uh, around eight hours. I'm just now getting to New Atlantis. So if that gives you any indication of how long this playthrough is going to be for me. Uh... Bro, my intakes look great. What are you talking about? Get a whiff of this. Come here. Ah, you smell that? I don't care. It's really fun and the bugs are fun. I haven't encountered any bugs yet. I'm not going to knock on wood, honestly, because I hope I do. But I call that Bethesdian charm. You know what I mean? I'm sure they don't see it as a thing they don't want to celebrate. Like we have bugs. All right. Like chill out. <laughs> we don't want to celebrate that. But to me, I think it's dope. Bring on the bugs. Give me more. <laughs> Not game breaking. What's up, brother? Been, if my ship goes long again, my girl is going to kill me. I'm sorry I interrupted you. You were talking about brownouts. I think I got them. What do you call them? Corns? Yeah, I got corns. Bro. You can't just walk around telling strangers you got corns. Especially with them feet right there. With them? With these? Now I feel like I got x-ray vision. Like I can, I can see the corns. Your bunions? Like, ah, oh man. Hey, try and be careful, okay? Don't want a ship landing on your head. Nice goatee, brother. Can I just go in here? ID card reader? I don't know if I have one of those. Yeah, I don't got one of those. I'm sorry. Oh, shelves. Before you, uh, before you go in lurk mode, which by the way, first and foremost, thank you for the raid. Good looking out. Welcome Raiders. I'm okay. Adrian, blah, blah, blah. Introduction, that kind of stuff. But what did you go with? What is your type and what are your traits? I'm finna hack this. It's hacking time. Works in the top layer, definitely. Uh, doesn't work in the bottom layer, okay. This one works in the top layer. Works in the bottom layer, so we'll save that one. This one works in the top and bottom layer, so we'll save that one. This one also works in top and bottom layer. Okay. This one works in the top layer. And the bottom layer, just like those two do. Hey, bet. So we'll use this one first. I'm a sculptor, and I did empath, and I can't remember the other one. I'm a starved artist. Are you RPing? I like it. I thought about empath, but man, that's rough. Like if I'm right about them and treat them right, I get the bonus. But if I fuck up, then I lose the bonus. I don't know, man. You gotta be right every time. 
or at least be right more often than you're wrong. So six out of 10. I believe in you though. Give me that for sure. Light work. Light work, let me in. Open door. Easy. Leet hacksers. Body adi 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 adi. That dude's unaware. Ha! <laughs> I went with uh I'm an industrialist. Industrialist, and I chose a uh, serpent. Uh, so I'm in a cult. Uh, also, I have parents. And also, um, uh, hero appreciation. And constant need of attention, just like in real life. The game speaks to me in ways I wouldn't thought possible. But yeah. Separate embrace, let's go! For the next four hours. Thank you, culting. Yeah. Industrialists. Serpents embrace, hero worshipped, and kid stuff. Yeah. So in a cult, Twitch, hero worshipped, uh, also Twitch, content creation, and kid stuff. It's real life. You know what I mean? Oh, by the way, <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm very proud of myself. My character's name is, uh, because I'm an industrialist, which means I gotta be a mega corporation capitalist. My character's name is uh, Isla Fisher Price. Very proud of myself. I'm starting a new Fisher Price, intergalactic Fisher Price. If Mattel can make a Barbie film several years later and make billions, then I will make a Fisher Price film in space and make billions. Milk, magnet, package for Nisa. Oh. What's that all about? Let me see. Interesting. A sub quest for getting that. What's that mission called? Still in confidence. I've managed to acquire the cargo that Nissa Mercano needs and should deliver it to her. Now she can wait. She can wait. After all, I stole this package, so I'm not in a hurry to like play errand boy, you know what I mean? Oh, you can grab? Yo, that's elite. I thought I was just out of jet fuel and that was a wrap. I didn't know we had grab mechanics. Let's go. All right, I think we're done in here. Nothing else of value. No, we chilling. Peace. Don't snitch. Homie never saw it. I'm him. Him in space. Space him. Like, this is the problem with games like this for me. I know my destination is right there and that's what I should be doing, but look at all this open space that I can go explore instead. Like, what's to stop me from going over there to see what's over there? Absolutely nothing. And that's why games like this are violently toxic to me. Immensely oppressive. Like, how many of you resist the temptation to go over here and just went straight into New Atlantis's little hub? Cause I admire you. That must be nice. Me? I can't do that. I gotta talk to this person to see what's up. This technician. Uh, yes, what? Yes. All right, cool. Good talk. Worth it. Is that a fucking ladder? Can I go somewhere? Yo. Can I climb something? I don't think it goes anywhere. Oh, it's a lift. Anything on the lift? Any treats? Nope. Whack.
I still feel like I made the right choice going over here. This is so badass, man. Crew chief Kane Harath. Thinking about joining up with the Vanguard? Talk to Commander Twalov at last. He'll get you in the system. Oh, I can join the Vanguard. I've heard some people get bored at their jobs. <laughs> Think I'd like to try that someday. Are you like your job? Well, you are a crew chief, which means you probably make crew chief money. So I'm sure you are big chillin'. You have the mustache and everything. Oh, a cafeteria? Say less. Employees only? All right, bet. Cargo on hold. Nothing. That was storage B, right? So this is storage A. Restricted area. What are you gonna do? Find me? Is some nerd gonna run up to me and say, excuse me, um, actually, if you're not an employee, you can't be in this cafeteria. This is for employees only. Do you have any kind of identification? Like, miss me with all that. I will take this weight plate and put it across your face. Oh man, I can get some chunks. Some cereal. Ooh, some wine. Yo, wait a minute. If I drink wine, I get a 12% increase in persuasion chance. Tap that. Restrict this di this dinner I'm carrying in my inventory. Nice, nice catch. Good catch, good catch, good catch, good catch. Oh, by the way, of course, it goes without saying, make sure you follow uh, Lux, homie. I don't think I've actually seen Lux since like, I mean, I lurk the channel whenever I can, you know, obviously, but like, I don't think I've seen Lux since 2018 TwitchCon. There was like a after party, one of several after parties. And it was, I think myself her and quality bears i think at the time maybe morpher's please i think it was the last time that i saw her in person it's amazing just how twitch works you know how frequently you see some people and not others of course i mean when you're in this business that happens a lot you know which is why I have to appreciate every chance you get to spend with anybody. Neo City Hustler outfit? It better be a pimp cane and pimp outfit. I love it. A lot of y'all folks would come back to your area and realize you ain't got nothing left. I just want to tell you ahead of time, my bad. But. To my credit, I'm not an employee and I don't belong in here. So I feel like theft is only necessary. You know what I mean? I'm just doing what's required of me. If I worked here, I wouldn't take those things, right? Because why would I? I'm not a monster. But since I don't work there, I feel like it's only my right that I take the things that don't belong to me. All right, cool, Krat. Get some rest. Take care. And for those of you who came from the Lux Raid, my name is Okadrian. As of January, I'm a 10 year Twitch partner, uh, Twitch ambassador also. I'm also a game dev, community manager. Uh, I was on GameStop TV for two years. If you worked at a GameStop, you saw me in one of the 5,000 stores. I'm also a host and I'm also an interviewer. And that's one of the main things that I do. E3, TwitchCon, uh, Xbox, Intel, shoutcasting for grinding gear games, Path of Exile. I do a lot of things. I have my finger in a lot of pies. So welcome to the stream. This is OK Purview you're watching. Home of the Classroom, capital ASS. 
It is September, so if you want to follow the example set forth by Flint Shop, that would be dope. Flint Shop's been doing it for 33 months. That could be you. That could be you with bragging rights saying, man, I've been at Adrian's place for like 33 months. And the cool thing is, if you sub right now, not only do you benefit me and yourself, but Flint Shop will give you a juice box. Now, normally you shouldn't accept like juice from strangers, but this is the classroom. We don't share everything, but we do share those. Also, hello, Flynn. How are you? I'll just impact drivers, whatever. They say some Xenobirds can sing a song only their mate can hear, so they can find each other in large flocks. Really? I'm just trying to imagine my partner in the crowd singing to me. It's the opposite of romantic. <laughs> if all of you out there had a partner who could sing a song that only you could hear in a crowd, so you could point out where they were in a crowd, what song would it be? Mine would be that song by Hawthorne Heights. Cause my heart is in Ohio. To cut my red and black my eyes. Cut my red and black my eyes. So I can fall asleep tonight or die because you kill me. That's what my SO was singing the crowd that I'd be like, ah, oh, there they are. And only I could hear it. Pardon me. All right, do you? How's it going? Not bad. How are you? Okay, goodbye. Reinventing the wheel to run myself over. Okay. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, uh, well, of, of course, uh, that's sure possible. <laughs> uh, we'll, ju uh, we'll just... <clears throat> Helena Chambers, ID SSCOM 1327HCHA. I was the station administrator. I'll need to report to MAST ASAP for a full debrief. My treatment thus far has been entirely unacceptable. Any authority you had was forfeit the moment House Varun Zealots breached the station's perimeter and you failed to initiate proper evacuation protocols. <laughs> Thank you for your service. We'll find you a new position commensurate with your experience. <laughs> and Mr. Bosch, let me just say how honored I am to meet you. By all accounts, you're the only reason anyone made it out of their life. Yo! Well, just glad I still remembered my flight basics. It had been a while. So was shooting a gun. I read all about New Atlantis. So cool. Shut up, Bobby. Is it true that the Nat train goes 5,000 miles an hour? Or that citizens get special discounts? Or that the whole city celebrates when it's your birthday? Wait, what? Mine's June 11th, by the way. My parents took me to Aquila City last year. It kind of smelled. But I don't smell anything here. Um, no, yes, no. And I will certainly mark June 11th on my calendar. Nice answers. As for Aquila City, well, the air purifiers here in New Atlantis are state of the art. Ugh. Aquila City. Oh, don't even get me started on those simpletons. Ah, uh, little unfair, don't you think? Free Star Rangers helped me out quite a bit a couple years back. Got ambushed by spacers near Narion. They assisted, no questions asked. Even helped with some repairs so I could do an emergency jump home. Good people. Talk to him. In any event, you all must be exhausted. Just give me a moment to coordinate some details with security. May I help you? Does that oh, Guess you caught some of that, huh? The galaxy is at peace and somehow seems more dangerous than ever. 
Spacers, House Varun, Crimson Fleet. Everyone trying to grab their piece. Amen. What happened to the early days, huh? When we just float through the stars and dream. Hey, that's me. Shut up, Bobby. <laughs> also, welcome to the stream. Fuck off, Bobby. No, mum. <laughs> yo, yo, Johnny, I should have told him. Hey, Bobby, did you know that I'm an industrialist? So did you know that one of my traits as an industrialist, too, is that I have parents? Isn't that dope? What about you? Oh, wait, you didn't choose that trait, did you? Oh, wait, you had that trait and it's gone. LOL. Kick rocks, kid. She sounds like a pussy from Orange is New Black. Nice. Also, hello, Reem. That's Wesley Crusher. I don't know Wesley Crusher. Uh, Spacers, who are they? We're saying something. Oh, sorry, Spacers, who are they? Really? <laughs> you must have been hiding under a moon rock your whole life if you've managed to dodge those assholes. <sighs> They're basically a bunch of space scumbags. Fly around, attack, and rob anyone they see. They're pretty disorganized and easy to fend off until they aren't. They're a different beast than the Crimson Fleet. Generally speaking, pirates want your stuff, so they can occasionally be reasoned with. Okay. Spacers, though. They tend to shoot first and ask questions never. Did they steal the rest of your facial hair, Clark Gable? Like, what are we doing? I'm in bed holding hands with Maple. Uh, ooh, ooh, then. I hear that. Shout out to Bojack Horseman. I hear that. House Faroon, what's that? Not what. Who? Okay. How to describe House Faroon? Well, imagine a, a bunch of colonists who set off into the stars ages ago. Okay. And disappeared. And then re-emerged as a sort of religious society. Yeah. Faction or cult, whatever you want to call them. They believe in some sort of celestial deity called yes! the Great Serpent. Me too! Uh, real nightmare fuel kind of stuff. Those are my people! About a hundred years back, they picked a fight with pretty much everyone in the settled systems. I guess your school never covered the Serpent's Crusade, huh? We eventually made peace, sort of. Then they just disappeared. They're out there somewhere, or so folks assume. The ones that attacked us, they were the hardliners for sure. You meet those guys, you run. You understand me? I will not. I also believe in the Great Serpent. Better watch your mouth. I hope House Maroon falls, finds me. Oh, poo say. Got it. I never watched an episode of Orange is the New Black. Maybe one day. One day when I retire and I can watch all the TV shows and movies that I missed out on. I mean, TV shows are just like video games where there's some I've watched a lot of and some I've never seen. People were like, what? You've watched Home Improvement, but you've never watched The Sopranos. You've watched Weeds, but you've never watched Orange is the New Black. You've watched The Walking Dead, but you've never watched Breaking Bad? That's humans for you. We can ruin a glass of water. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Well, still, I hold out hope. There are more good people than bad in this galaxy. Is that true? It's just that the bad are... Uh, louder. Retirement home, you? Yeah, dude. Retirement home for me? I'm going to have so much television to watch. I should start a list right now. Retirement home Adrian's watch a list. Instead of like lo-fi beats to study and relax and chill to, just like missed out programming to decay and relax to. You know what I mean? Was there anything else? Who are you? Ricardo Bosch. I was the lead researcher on the station that got attacked. It was business as usual until those House Varun crazies swarmed in, Whoa. spouting their scripture. Whoa, and whatever it not was. crazies. Even the Marines were overwhelmed. Honestly, I'm just lucky to have made it out of there in one piece. 
We all are. Now, I just want to get back to work. Where is that woman? You know what this reminds me of? Remember in the Outer Worlds? Uh, what is it? The second or third character you meet is that a uh, priest who's looking to leave behind the religious society that he belongs to. Reminds me of that. Better Call Saul is better anyway. So here's the thing. I've only watched three episodes of Breaking Bad, but I've watched like three seasons of Better Call Saul and I fucking love Better Call Saul. Breaking Bad for the first time is different. I don't know, man. I feel like everybody would say that with any top tier show. I've even gone back recently and I've started rewatching. Um... You were saying something? Shut up. I'm talking. Um... Show on HBO. Uh, about the Atlantic City scene and Prohibition era stuff. I keep I'm drawing a blank on this. Boardwalk Empire, thank you. Boardwalk Empire. You can tell how sleepy I've been lately, but I just started rewatching that. So I forgot all about it, ironically enough. That boy can act his ass off, by the way. You wanna rewatch The Wire? As you should. I feel like you had to be watching Breaking Bad at the time. I tried to rewatch it now times just as a stand up in my opinion. Ooh, so it aged. Interesting. I wonder if the Sopranos is the same way. So you've run into the Crimson Fleet too, huh? Yep, that I have. Had to dump a load of cargo just last year. Microscopes. Can you believe that? <laughs> Guess you can sell anything these days. Pirates are a tricky lot. In space, they're all about the hit and run. They jump in, steal your stuff, and get out of there fast. Keep your cool, and you can generally talk your way out of it, so long as you're not too attached to your valuables. Stumble upon them planet side, though, and their trigger fingers get much itchier. Okay, so pirates in space, cool pirates on terrestrial, awful. Got it. I think Boardwalk Empire 2 also has me hooked because of the name, like Nucky, <laughs> Nucky Thompson. I had watched it when it first came out, and I watched the first two seasons and didn't go back to it. So now I'm just rewatching to see if I like it again. Certain shows I watch once and never again, other ones I'll come back to over and over again. Other ones I'll watch and then rewatch just to get used to it again. Boardwalk Empire is one of those watched once and want to return back to, whereas, uh, Bojack Horseman is a show that I'll watch all the time. Same for Bob's Burgers. Anything else? And then there are certain shows that I watch once and never again, like Fargo. I watch each of those seasons once and then never again. Although the last season with uh, Chris Rock and um, Jason Schwartzman was really good. Also, the new and final season of Archer, season 14, is really good. And it's the best season of Archer I've seen in a long time. Goodbye. Bye. This bitch. Hello, Helena Bye. Chambers. Shut up, Bobby. What? No, just ugh, go away. Oh wait, can I just do this? Can I help you? Can I? Can I just? Yes. No way! Oh, wait. Don't swing. Does she have a gun? I am not sure why. She is fast. She's got burners. Helena had burners. She had burners. She runs a four four forty. Why is everyone attacking me? Y'all didn't even know her like that. Y'all didn't even know her like that. You think shit's sweet? You think shit's sweet? Come on. 
You think shit's sweet? Come get it. Not you too. Are you security? I'm security now. Zigzag, 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 zigzag. Serpentine, duck. I missed both shots. You reload, I reload. Target identified. Yeah, clearly. Welcome to Earth. Wait, no, no, no. I'm sorry. Wait, no, no. I surrender. I surrender. I surrender. I give up. I will go to jail for the murder of Helena Chambers. No, wait. I, I surrender. I'm unarmed. I'm not holding a gun. I give up. I give up. I give up. Here, here. I surrender. I surrender. I surrender. I surrender. Hey, I give up. I'm unarmed. It is a shame. Exploration requires so much bloodshed. I surrender. I'm unarmed. I'm not a threat. I, I can't see. Look. I'm on my hands and knees crawling to you. Look. They use my photos from my photo gallery as loading screen photos. That's so tight. May I help you? Hey. Plot twist. Nobody again. liked Helena and now they're dead. They're just going to the motions. True. Can, Can I see I your help? character? Yeah, there you go. In before frowny face. Oh, no, 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 none of that, none of that. No, no, no. Hold on, Reem. Let's do, uh. Hi. Let's do, uh. Space suit. Oh, hide helmet in breathable areas. Yeah, let's do that. There you go. Incredibly attractive, right? I know. Awooga. Where was the hide helmet option? If you go into your helmet options right here, press T, show helmet in breathable areas. Hope that helps. <laughs> yes, uh, freckles, uh, pock marks, makeup with the under eye shadow, the over eye shadow. Perfect eyebrows, curly hair, just like me. Like hoop earrings, because why wouldn't I? I met my Baldur's Gate 3 guardian. She's so pretty. Just like you. It's the hoops, to be honest, right? This place is so unserious. That's why I have my hoops in. The hoops only come off. The hoops only come off if it's like serious, serious business. Otherwise, the hoops stay off. You know what I mean? How do I go unarmed? How do I just go fist? I feel like I can I feel like I can punch you in the face and not be penalized for it. Shooting you is a deal breaker. I understand that now. But if I just like Yeah, if I just duff you, I feel like no one's gonna give a fuck. She can't do this to me. Really? Over a punch in the face? Are y'all for real right now? There's no shot. This is America. This is just space America. 
over a punch in the face. They are just like real cops. I can't, she can't do this to me. Mink. May I help you? She, I told you, oh. Reem, she runs a 4440. Like she is combine ready. She is a, now. she is a five-star collegiate athlete. That meme, I'm fast as fuck, boy. Her. How did that bullet get through your guard was up? I know. I thought maybe I could be like the heavy weapons guy in Team Fortress 2. Eat one sandwich and just run up like this and be okay, but I guess not. If I get dialogue options with Bobby, but I don't with Helena, I'll be upset. Does that woman have any idea who I am? Oh, fuck off. Hey. I've never been in a battle before. Everyone kept telling me to keep my eyes closed, but it's kind of hard to do that when you're running. At first, I thought it was ecliptic mercenaries shooting at us, but it wasn't. It was these other people yelling about serpents and stuff. <laughs> what does the little boy know about mercenaries? Yes. When it comes to ecliptic, I know everything. It's not like it's a secret. They're mercenaries, so they work for money. And it's like, for enough money, they'll do anything. I've heard a couple of SSNN stories about them. My dad says they're horrible. Like they can pretend they're working for someone and it's official, so they do anything they want. <laughs> Such a dork. Yeah, I feel that, Reem. Serpents? Yeah, it was like snakes and serpents will eat you all. Rah, the stars will squeeze you, Rah, or something like that. I think they need psychiatric help. Bobby, you know that I am a serpent worshiper, right? Like, you know, that's me. Uh, Cap. Cap. Galaxy's a tough place, kid. Is that really an appropriate thing to say to a child? Anyway, I'm fine now. I hope my parents don't take too long getting here. <laughs> All right. No, just uh, go away. All right, Sheldon. <laughs> May I help you? No, I'm good. You see that scientist out in front of mast, staring at trees? Sounds upset. Whatever it oh. is, it can't be that bad, right? I don't know. I don't know where Mast is, so no. <laughs> Let's show it. <laughs> Parents are dead, kid, and the galaxy sucks. Fuck you, get out of here. <laughs> you sound like MJF. Who's gonna tell him? I mean, Reem. A mouse bot, but it's like a Gigantamax mouse bot. Where is Potato? Saren. Cute robot. Twaffle is my favorite. It's my favorite thing in the Star Wars universe. Y'all can have your battles about which lightsaber dueling style is the best. Is it this stance? Is it that stance? Uh, you prefer Mandalorians? Who's the sexiest Twi'lek or whatever? Uh, which lore is the right lore? Who has the best command over the force? Dark Plagueis, the wise. I don't give a fuck. But mouse droids? That's my shit. Why is that not a dialogue option? I don't know. 
This is the same person from Chappelle's show. The black dude who said, I'm a 45 year old white man from uh, Iowa or whatever, who works in a Coke bottling factory. Prices on raw materials have really dropped lately. It's those independent. Further advice steer clear of the well. Yeah, goodbye. Nah. It's disrespectful even talking to you. That's just you know, I went to chef school. The same exactly where I saw myself. I feel like you need a diary or a Tumblr. Like you shouldn't offload that on just random people. And no, you shouldn't be a chef. I'm seeing how you act as a security officer for punching somebody in the face. You think it'd be Chef Gordon Ramsay? Chef Gordon Ramsay just yells at people. If you got angry as a chef, I see what you do. It'd be a bloodbath. What did she say? She said that uh, her future, she wanted to be a chef, and this isn't where she saw herself. Mind you, this is the same person that if you punch Helena in the face, she starts unloading 45 cal rounds into your chest. So... Welcome to New Atlanta security checkpoint. You will be scanned. That sounds threatening. Am I allowed in here? Hello. Are you sure about that? You don't need to wear your helmet on this planet. You know that, right? Oh shit, it didn't save my option. My bad, bro. Good looking out. I didn't save after that previous kerfuffle. Good look. Chef, you can't use an SMG to cut the chicken. <laughs> Car me with a gun. Hello. Hello. Wait, can I? Can I just take your shit? Can I 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 take your grenades? Can I take your grenades? Check it out. Sure you can get the frame folder, foam cup. I kind of want to steal from him just to be a dick. You know what I mean? I wish I could pick these things up and throw them. Oh, it says steal. It actually is theft. Oh. Nah, if I punch someone in the face and y'all shoot at me, then I'm pretty sure stealing is the death penalty. What's the difference? The death penalty has a show attached to your death. Punching someone, you just get executed on the spot. You steal? They're going to like turn your death into a musical. It's going to be like Hamilton, but your death. Cats, but your death. No, thank you. You're right, LaShoy. Wait, you can see that on there? Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a DP, an A and B, B and E, or heaven forbid, an MS. But at least then we wouldn't have to worry about a VOP, am I right? You might charge me for a B and E later on, depending on what I find. He might also charge me for a DP if I find what I find. You know? <laughs> Didn't laugh. Oh. Oh, a security office. Bro, multiple interior areas. We are thriving right now. I am never going to beat this game. Hi there. Hello there. Nothing good comes from the well. Amen. Pretty cool. I didn't know that. I thought you had bare feet on for a second. Wait, are you wearing slides? Like heel? Uh flat heels? And I they're not heels, Asian, but um flats with those tights?
Nope. Oh, self-service bounty clearance. Nice. So I can pay for my own bounty if I have a bounty? I'm not wanted by any faction. Shoutouts to me. Yet. Well, oh, mission board. What? Oh. I can hunt pirates? They really did copy No Man's Sky homework. Deliver. Oh my God. That can't be right. 2,000 kilos of meat byproducts. My good bitch. Bro. That's so much. That's like 5,000 pounds, I think, of meat. You have become encumbered. I'm saying. This is basically privateer kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, the thing is so far in the, in Adrian time, it's been the first 10 hours and everyone else's time it's the first two hours of gameplay. But in the first two hours of gameplay, you can collect everything. You can cook, you can craft. You can negotiate, you can do missions, uh, you can kill people if you want to, recklessly, and sneak, and I encountered the build menu, but I canceled out of it, and you can explore, of course, so there's so much you can do. Are there different races? Uh, not, well, so far I haven't seen any different races yet. It's been all humans. I mean, I guess if you count creatures. There was a terramorph, which slaughtered an entire like scientist laboratory and uh, a couple of Marines, but I took it on solo easy, but I'm just different, I guess. I don't know. But uh, no, no Asaris, no Quarians, no Krogans. Sorry, no Hanar. Is there a Tortilla delivery quest we can pick up too? Why would you like some? Oh, no, but there is some non bread that I've been saving. I haven't eaten it yet. I'm not going to deliver it to you, though, because I'm saving it for a special occasion. Only problem is the game says it only restores three HP, which I think is kind of fucking whack. You heard me, Reem. What is this? How are you doing? It's been a while since we had a chance to catch up. I'm doing great, actually. Thanks for asking. In fact, things have been going so well. I'm kind of worried for when my luck does. Are you on the phone? You on the phone? You on the phone? Hope you're not agoraphobic. No, I'm not. Je vous demande pardon. <laughs> Uh, I could le pas français. So nice fucking try. So I beg your pardon. No time to chat. No, 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 no. You want to speak in French? Let's go. Je parle français un peu aussi. Let's go. Kind of in the middle of something here. Mm hmm. I always wondered what the inside of the lodge looks like. The nigga go on vacation. Wouldn't want to live anywhere else. It's a functional info desk. Wowie wow wow. She Frenched at the wrong person. I got that Wolverine energy. Got any games on your phone? Actually, Reem, I'm happy you said that. I do. So months ago, someone made a comment, like actually about a year ago. There was a new cat game coming out and uh, I looked for it on my iPhone and it wasn't out yet. And so I put in one of those requests to notify me when the game is available and download it. And the game is called Usagi Shima. And it's one of those, remember that old, remember that cat game 
It was popular like pre-pandemic in the pandemic with the cute little cats, like the Pusheen style cats. It's kind of like that. It's like Pusheen style cats, but also Pusheen rabbits and things like that. And it just came out yesterday and auto downloaded on my phone. My phone was like, hey, cute, cute games available. So yes, I only have three games on my phone. Usaki Shima, Street Fighter Duel, and Retro Bowl, which is like Tecmo Bowl. It's short ballistic fun. By ballistic, I don't mean actual guns. I mean the firepower of the game itself is quick firing. The only other game I'll have on my phone is the Final Fantasy game coming out. That used to be on the old phones and is being repurposed to new generations phones. But I think it comes out uh comes out this week actually. Wow. Can I spell it for you? Yeah. No, <laughs> put <Flip shop> nothing. <laughs> I have not watched Severance, but I do have access to Apple TV through my uh, sister's account. I think I've only watched like one thing on Apple TV. You know, when Apple TV first started, I thought Apple TV was a meme because the shows they were advertising in the John Hamm commercial about Tom Hanks. I was like, LOL, Apple TV, like you're trying to compete with Netflix and Hulu and Peacock, like what original content do you have? And then I feel like Post lockdown, Apple TV has been on fire with like every show everyone wants to watch has been on Apple TV. But I wanted to watch Severance because it stars, uh, what's his name, who played Ben White on Parks and Rec. Welcome to New Atlantis. How many pages is this? Two pages? Hello, welcome to the city of New Atlantis, capital of the United Colonies, and for many of the settled systems as a whole. Puff your chest out a bit for that one. You stand now in the most technologically advanced city the human race has ever conceived and constructed. New Atlantis was founded in the year 2156, the same year we first arrived in the Alpha Centauri star system. If you're a resident, then you're already familiar with your fantastic home, and if you're a visitor, you are an honored guest of the United Colonies and will be treated as such unless you punch someone in the face and you'll be shot down on the streets like a wild animal. Our courteous and professional security personnel can be found all over the city, and it's their job to ensure your time in New Atlantis is joyful, lawful, productive, and murderous. So as you stroll the streets or take the Nat train to the city's different districts, know that you are in the embrace of the United Colonies and couldn't be in better hands unless you place those hands on us and we'll put our hands back on you. Good talk. Corporate directory. Oh, shit. Oh, the well. I've already met like three NPCs that said the well sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that means Jake's? It's kind of ass? I kind of want to go to the well now and talk to Jake and be like, yo, you know, they're saying this place sucks, right? <laughs> it's their job to do what? Wait, go back. It's their job to ensure my time here is joyful, lawful, and productive. Smiley face. The house of enlightenment is in the well. The med base in the well. Why is the well ass? Oh, for sure, Reem. It's definitely in the United States. Oh, wow. You know what? Nice job, graphical settings. Nice job. Draw distance looks good. Shadowing is good. Everything looks dope. Who the fuck is this cartoon character? Yeah. I'm kind of busy right now. Okay. Why are you staring? I wasn't staring. I was looking at the poster. I was I was reading the poster.
The security office reminds me of the same security office that you visit in Deus Ex. You know what I mean? Except <laughs> blue and cool hues instead of uh, brown and gold hues. Hey, uh, Sergeant Yumi, I like to report an assault. I punched someone in the face and I was shot several times for it. Explain. Well, hello. You hear about the job by any chance? Huh. Uh, the officer over there can help you with any bounty issues. Job? As in work for the police force? You can kiss my ass. I got enough to do right now. Totally understand. But if you're looking to make some credits and serve the United Colonies at the same time, you just let me know. Yeah, unless your name is Archangel or Garrus, then I'm afraid we can't work together. My bad, dog. Oh, is that how it works, one job? My bad, then never mind. Damn, he's handsome, except for when he talks. You know what? There is a very similar uh, fade, side fade right there that somebody else has. I can see your appeal. The appeal he has for you. If you'll excuse me. Oh, you have a name. Functionary Brooks. I am really in the middle of something. Oh, you were the one outside explaining stuff. Yeah, you're badass. I love you. No soliciting. Do I need to call security? Goodbye. No, I've seen what security does. I've seen how they react. So, no thank you. I'm chilling. My bad. That's on me. Ooh, can I just... Can I just... Night. Sergeant Yumi is looking for reliable people to help the guard. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all appreciate it. Why would they be scared of me going back here anyway? Considering they're just going to shoot me anyway. Like, why would this be a problem? Oh. 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 Is this jail? Can I just go to jail and take a nap? We're hiring if you are interested. Ask in the security office. Yo, I can just go sleep in jail? Word? Yo! Scripture of the Great Serpent, that's my people. Permanently increases sneak bonus by 1% and melee sneak damage by 5%. Permanently? Gang, gang. Glug, 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 glug. Ah, delicious. See, see, Priya, my people just got it right. I have nothing to say. Oh, it's quiet from MGS5. What happened to you? Do not bother me. Serpent's embrace. Wait, what? I'm having a crisis of faith. There are not. No way. Are you my people? I'm having a crisis of faith. There's not many people I can talk to about it. Oh, you follow the path. You are in a strange land full of lies and ignorance. Yes, I you am. Must hold true. Otherwise, when the Great Serpent returns, you most certainly will perish. I don't want that. Oh, my God. It's just too hard to put into words. Matters like this often are. Yeah. I know, like you must truly know, deep down. Yes. That the Great Serpent's rise is inevitable. I've been saying that shit. There will be no place. For those who turn their back on this, you must excise this doubt You're right. for your sake. Oh, wow. I can just leave? Nah, your words have helped uh, a lot. Both of us are deep inside the unfaithful's lands. Stay true, my friend. You too, my friend. I desire no company. Leave. How did you end up in that cell? 
The Great Serpent called me to fight the unbelievers in the United Colonies. As he often does. But I was ambushed and my ship disabled. Ah. Now I am here. I hate that shit. We're breaking her out, right? Absolutely. Who are you? I am a prisoner. Mm. Trapped by a weak people <laughs> who do not kill their enemies when they should. Yeah. All right. We busting you out. Like, I'm not even going to make it a secret. I'm just going to open your damn cell. How do I... Unlock expert. I wonder if I can unlock this door, sneak up behind you and like give you something. Hey man. Got a call. Whoa. Power kept going out. Know what it was? What? A heat leech as what? As my leg. Yuck. Yeah, I have that same problem with my dick. <laughs> How do I break you out? Can I just go behind here and open this up? Hold on, friend. I'm going to brush you out of there. You don't belong in there. I'm going to get you out of there. I promise. All right, bro. We got to talk. You got to set, you got to set them free. My mother wanted me to be a doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Mothers. Am I right? Yeah, man. <laughs> Anyway, uh, this is my friend. I need you to let them out of here. Uh, the Great Serpent demands it. Or we can exchange it and the Great Serpent will demand your head. The choice is yours. So be it. No digit fucks. My friend, I will come back for you. Believe in me. I will break you out of here. The Great Serpent wills it. They'll wish they had killed you when they had the chance. And they'll wish they had killed me. Everything good? We're here to help. <laughs> oh yeah, everything is real. Sorry! Sorry! Wrong buttons! Sorry! 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 Sorry. Sit tight. We need to level up a lot, probably. I yeah. To be an actuary. Now look at me. Can't believe I can't access your computer just to, like bust them out. Is that a camera? Oh, for sure it is. So I can't just like knock you out and take the key. Do you have keys? You have keys? Can I pickpocket? I probably need the skill to pickpocket. You got any keys in your butt? Open your butt. Let me see. Oh, all right. Well, how kind of you. I guarantee Welcome you there's keys somewhere. All right, bet, 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 bet. I'm going to get them out of there. Believe that. I'm going to get them out of there. Katie, I'm going to get them out of there. The Great Serpent wills it. All right, Vasco, come this way. Close this door. First, I'm going to steal. Sketch him. Vanessa, hello. Hello. Something to report? Yeah, my friend's in jail. Can you, like, set them free? Because I feel like a space criminalized institution should have learned better from the mistakes we've made. Did you know jails were originally invented to capture runaway slaves? Do you care? Of course you don't, bitch. Now, what can I steal? Theft, 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 theft. Oh, security key card. Yes. Why? What do you mean? Fuck 12. Say it louder. Kill this man and free your homie. It's not that easy. Hey, no funny stuff with that boost pack. 
Got enough flight traffic as it is. Oh, you mean this boost pack? So first and foremost, uh, security's right there. So I can't just duff homeboy as much as I want to. This is the homie. Uh, they believe in a cult called the Great Serpent. Here's the plot twist. So do I. So I got to bust him out of there. That video of the dude with the cat in the flower shop. You don't belong in there. I'm going to get you out of there. That's me right now. Swing on them. All right, cool. Let me show you what happens. You know, good point. Good point. Yeah. I'm going to show you exactly. I already tried that. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. Because I had the same idea. Like, why don't I just swing on this dude and call it a day? Why am I making it a thing? Excuse me. Mink. You see security. Give up now. Fire, fire. That's why. Did that work? <laughs> Niggas can't open doors. <laughs> no. Why would you do that? Why would you open the? All right, peace. I'm gonna get you out of there. I'm gonna get you out of here. All right, um, stop opening the goddamn door. As my mom would say when I was nine years old, stay in or stay out. Why are you swinging at me? I'm your friend. What, what? We're part of the same squad. No, I rep Grove Street too. I'm Third Street Saint. Shit. I apologize. I'll go to jail. I'll go to jail. I'll go to jail. I'll go to jail. I'm in jail. I'm in jail. I'm sorry. I'm in jail. I'm sorry. I'm in jail. Let's go to sleep. I can't sleep when enemies nearby. Bro, I'm in jail. You can't shoot me in jail. Actually, happened to Epstein. It could happen to me. I give up. Anyway, to answer your question earlier about why I didn't just swing on them, I hope that answers your question. Hope that helps. Thank you, Katie, for the raid. Welcome, everyone. Nice to meet you. My name is Oak Adrian. I'm a 10 year partner as of January. I'm also a Twitch ambassador for two and a half years now. I'm also a game developer a community manager and I've been doing hosting and interviewing since 2016. I was the host of TwitchCon last year with Cup of Noodle for the entire event. I've done E3, Comic-Con, The White House. I was on GameStop TV in the in-store place for two years. I've also done shoutcasting for Path of Exile and I have two shows that I do on Twitch. One called ADTNTP, which stands for All Dang, There's Nothing to Play. And another one called uh, Wax on Wax, where I talk to other creators about their vinyl collection and why they got into vinyl. So, Katie is obviously the homie. Vanessa is obviously the homie. Both of them are homies. I last saw them collectively in uh, Memphis for the St. Jude meetup, which was obviously fantastic. It was my first time having um, Gus's world famous fried chicken. That shit was amazing. So, welcome. This is my stream called OK Purview. The conglomerate is called The Classroom. So, welcome. Ever wonder how the Crimson Fleet seems to be everywhere? It's because oh, I left and there was a raid. Welcome back. Everywhere. You made a gift from me? What do you mean? Any friend of Peek is a friend of mine. It's fun in here. It, the, it, this is... This is a roller coaster stream. Like what just happened recently, that whole sequence is the kind of thing that happens like once per hour. 
most times I'm just kind of hanging out in here, speaking in this tone of voice. Okay, blah, 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 RPing, reading things. And then once an hour, some chaos like that happens. So it's a roller coaster. It's this. Okay, let me see this. Let's see what this is. That's why. Does that work? <laughs> Niggas can't open doors. <laughs> no! Why would you do that? Why would you open the? All right, peace. <laughs> yeah. That's why. Good clip. Good clip. Dynamite. So, since you frequent speedrunning communities, Vanessa, if you happen to see someone take that, you know how the inventors are allowed to be uh, self-serving, masturbatory, and name it after them? That is officially called the Adrian Strat. And don't let anybody else tell you differently. So here we save time in this battle just by shutting the door. Uh, it's called the Adrian Skip. Anyway, this homie right here is part of the Great Serpent Society, like me. I'm just trying to set them free. But I stole a key card recently, and I guess that's not good enough to do it. Yeah, right here. UC security key card, which was stolen. It's contraband now. But I feel like that should open the cell door, and it doesn't. So imagine my sadness. Oh, that's right, man. You stepped away. You just saw actual proof of what took place. My bad. Good night, Vanessa. Sleep well. Oh, God. That's some bad whistling. What the fuck are we doing? Where can I use this key card then? I don't understand. This is so bunk. I wouldn't steal a key card if I didn't know I can't use it anywhere. Like, what's the point? I can't use the key card to bust you free. There's no icon to do it. I can't use the key card to open this door, which is locked, which by the way, spoiler alert, one would assume I could open a locked door with the, hold on, you guessed it, stolen key card. What can I do with the stolen key card? Nothing. Hey, man. Your ship coming. Nice ride. Hmm. Can I use the key card to expunge their records? Set them free? Y'all have a treadmill in house. Why is there a is that a throw up bucket? Are y'all those kind of trainers? Did you puke yet? No, keep running. Not the Excel sheets up on the entire terminal. My God. Imagine feeling the air blowing back on you from whistling inside the helmet and still doing it. I know, fogging your entire helmet up because you want to whistle a little tune. You can't just sing Sam Smith like everybody else. You got to whistle it instead. I am a little upset that I have this key card and I can't figure out where to use it. What if it's a red herring and I actually can't use it anywhere? All right, I made a mental note though. I made a mental note of them in jail and I will get you out of there. I don't know how yet, but like, I see you in there, homie. You've got a name, I'm gonna get you. I might set new Atlantis on fire. There was an outfit you can steal. Are oh, you thinking the old switcheroo? Put on an outfit and walk around and say, I'm a cop. Beep, bop, boop. And they'll go, hey, what's up, man? Another day, another shift. <laughs> Amen, brother. Yeah, it'd be like that, right? Yeah, 
damn, he knows better. <laughs> Did you see that long glance? He was like, I don't trust this bitch. And you shouldn't. And you shouldn't. Good instincts. Good instincts. Is that bourbon? Cat. What? Oh, fucking snitch bot. You you took everything that I stole? Everything that I nah. We've got a live one here. Take him down. Oh, I'm taking my stuff back. Y'all still about it? Open the door, you won't. I am aiming for your center of mass. Run it. Run it. That is a lot of gunfire. Oh, you are running them, aren't you? Mink, mink. Mink. Melee? Word? Mink. Anyway, I just started blasting. You ready to be set free? I desire no company. Please. It is a shame. Exploration requires so much. The enemy is no longer visible. Searching. I can actually use this opportunity to see what I can do when I can steal to get better in those cells. You stole their stuff fair and square. That's rude. You know, it's one thing to hold me responsible the for the things that I stole in front of them. It's another thing to act to like use me to return everything that I stole. I that's a bit much. Return everything. Hi, you have a gun? Then get away. I like you. I don't want to shoot you. Now you can get it. Nice tactic. You appear to be prioritizing our deaths over your own survival. Oh, did you see that run? I did you see no me? Detecting enemy activity in this Go area. side to side. Now, what can I steal in here properly? I'm a five star recruit. I'm telling you. Settler comfort wear. Foam comp. I like how I stole a security key card. No one saw it. No one threw a fit. But the minute, the minute I steal a cop's bourbon, now it's like, nah, welcome to Salty Bet. Come on, get those bets in. And you know what? I'm still taking the bourbon. A strong bourbon whiskey supposedly brewed using techniques from a place called Kentucky on Old Earth. You have your stolen stuff? Yeah, homeboy has it right here. See, <laughs> he's holding up for me right now. I'll pick it up in a second. Yo, you got to move your butt. Come on. You earned that bourbon. I might drink it right now. Frontier attire. Good for cop attire. So I can put that cop John on for a moment. Cyberware, streetwear. I don't think that will help. Salty bet. You like that reference? I still watch it from time to time. I've gone to sleep a couple of times to Salty bet. I don't know what that says about me, but I think it's entertaining to hear Super Saiyan Nightmare Level the Broly powering up as I catch some Z's. You know, hearing the sweet sounds of ah. Uh, while a Tuhu anime girl absolutely duffs his shit in 10 seconds over the course of two rounds. You know what I mean? It's just good stuff. It's just good stuff. It hasn't quite aged on me yet. It's still funny. Hmm. 
take all that. I don't think there's anything in here cop wise that'll assist me in what I'm trying to accomplish. Do you sleep to Apex streams? Man, you just you might love Apex more than three other people that I know. Or as much as three other people that I know. I think the other day I was perusing my Discord where it shows you who's playing what and then and I saw it. Zareem playing Apex. And I was like, ah, she's back. Oh, security uniform. A little late, right? <laughs> A little late. Are you named? You did not just teabag that cop. Vasco, the homie. And he's holding the teabag too. Let's go. That's my man's in them. Love that energy. There we go. Hello, I'm the police. Wait, where's my outfit? Motherfucker. Oh, it's my apparel. I'm a cop, but not really. Winky face. Can I set you free now? I have nothing to say. <sighs> Fuck. That is the best security camera I've seen in my entire life. One slug to the dome, still operational. Can I shoot doors open? My brother in Christ, excuse me? Oh my God. Damn. I guess. Everyone is dead and we have the key and an outfit and yeah, let me free them. They're named for a reason. I feel like maybe like it's all memes and jokes right now, but part of me feels like what really is happening is that later on there's going to be a quest that involves them where someone else says, hey, actually our leader got put up in jail. Can you break them out? And it'll activate a quest line for me to actually break them out. Or something happens later on where I'm on a colony and they break out on their own and they say, oh, it's you. Remember me? And I go, oh, yeah, I met you at the police station. That's what I feel like realistically. No memes is going to happen. But the only thing that bothers me is why would I get access to a security card that I don't know where I can use it? You know what I mean, and also it bothers me that this place is an arrow because this cell over here doesn't have an arrow. So why does this cell have an arrow pointing outwards? But actually, wait a minute. Is this arrow pointing to this cell right here that's locked? That's what I said before all this. What do you want credit for that? You don't get it. I didn't see it, so it doesn't count. I really want to open this cell up. This is, is this. Is this arrow pointing to that cell? Am I reading too much into this, you think? Do you think this arrow is pointing to that cell? But there's no reason this cell should have an arrow inside of it, right? Like, that's not, that's not an accident. Hmm. And it wouldn't point to this cell because I can just get in here and do whatever I want and nothing's in here. But the fact that it points to a lock cell has my wheels turning because I look in here and I see the thing. The ream skip. <laughs> when I skip over your comment. <laughs> no worries. Is it is it by ice or is it bice or is it vice? How do you say your name so I can acknowledge your lurk ice? All right, ice. Thank you. 
Enjoy your lurk. So first things first, I have to reload and I have to get a digipack so I can actually unlock this door and find out if my theory is correct. What's really concerning is the fact that like none of these nerds have a digipick in here. How are you a cop station? You have no digipicks. Ooh, you know what? I wonder if I go out in the world, if everyone's hostile or because everything happened in here, no one has any idea that I just murked the entire police force. Way to find out. Sorry, by the way, they get to see all that. What the f Hey, man. What's up? I guess y'all be closing soon, right? <laughs> yeah, y'all probably close. I should probably, um, I should probably head out of here. What, what are you up to? Looks like you got some fines to clear up. Wait, what? I can't pay it right now. That's fine. Just make sure you take care of this soon and don't get yourself in any more trouble. I'm sorry. Wait, what? Oh, no, hold on. No, hold on. 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 So you're telling me I can completely eradicate, headshot, eviscerate, obliterate, and erase five of your friends or coworkers from this entire planet or city of New Atlantis around the corner, come back. And you're like, all right, pay the fine of 37 credits. Or, hey, you know what? You can't pay it right now. No big deal. Just, you know, do it eventually, right? But if I go outside right now and I punch Helena Chambers right in the mouthpiece, I'm sentenced to death? You love that white woman more than you love your coworkers? He's got quotas. I then go find someone speeding. They were just cops, no big deal. That's his attitude. Couldn't stand his coworkers. You did him a favor, Terrence. He's probably right. They arrested me wrongly, but you free. <laughs> Sorry, man. Get a better lawyer. Who's my lawyer? Me. Imagine punching Curry in San Francisco. That's true. Jordan Poole, you can punch. Curry, you can't punch. Because no one wants to see Stephen Curry on the Washington Wizards. So. Quick load attorney at law. It'd be a great Cartoon Network or Adult Swim show. Who needs Harvey Birdman when you got this? I'm friends Smith and Wesson. Uh, I guess I'll just leave then. Um, thank you for nothing. This place sucks. Goodbye. Do you know what would be really funny? When you go to the bounty station to pay your bounty, if people could look over your shoulder to see what you have a bounty for. Like if there's a line queue and someone's behind you and they've got to pay like a fine five credits for shoplifting, they look over your shoulder and see fine, uh, seven counts of armed robbery, six counts of larceny, five counts of aggravated assault, two counts of attempted homicide, four counts of actual first degree murder, 35 credits. And you just pay and turn around and go, that's the system. Am I right? <laughs> That's our world. Shout outs to New Atlantis. <laughs> I can keep the stuff.
That's the shit that meant my right. Checking your record. Industrialist? Got a fancy name for corporate asshole. I don't know. Why don't you ask your friends inside the security station? Dick. Looks like you've got some fines to clear up. I mean, I give up. Do what you have to do. It's hardly worth the trouble of taking you in, but all right, come with me. Wait for real? You took my stuff? <laughs> there's there's still they don't even remove the, <laughs> imagine going to jail to see the same people you murked still there like, like what are we doing this is totally a Bethesda game and, and that sounds derogatory it's not this is just highly entertaining to me this is my kind of game. This is this is amazing. This is outstanding. This is a high body quality body of work. Like I'm beyond pleased. I'm pleased as punch. I'm I'm chuffed to bits, as my friends would say across the Atlantic. Splendid. I hope you're taking notes, Lux. It's like when you show your puppy the wet patch and just go no bad, and I'm like, alright, cool, and I just pee right in front of you again. Wag my tail and smile like LOL. Get it? Private sector. Now that's where the real money's at. He's chatty, huh? Their bundles are top tier. Why are you staring at me? Oh, I'm wearing the cop uniform still. That's actually funny as hell. I'm still going to reload the save before the uh, alleged uh, murder spree happened. Alleged. Innocent until proven guilty, right? Yeah, they didn't confiscate my cop uniform. <laughs> the thing is, one thing I don't understand yet uh, is... I have this on as my apparel, right? So technically this is on beneath my spacesuit, which is why they don't see it probably. But there's an option to show spacesuit and settlements and high spacesuit and settlements. But I don't know if the option to show in high spacesuit is aesthetic for me only, as in it just helps me the player be more engaged with what I'm seeing, or if order for others to acknowledge it, I have to actually remove this entire outfit. I can't I can't have it equipped. You know what I mean? I have to take it off. That I don't know. Excuse me. The ladder, I bet. I was thinking so too, because I just took it off. Hey there. I know your type. Freewheeling space ace. Must be nice. I feel like it's not doing me any favors right now having this on so tough to say back again not now no uh, thank you <laughs> yeah space 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 it's like when someone reads their first book and they just won't shut up about it or gets a brand new hobby and it's all I talk about is that hobby Bro, I'm telling you, I know I haven't shut up about it, but I'm telling you, like, CrossFit is the wave. I can't believe you don't CrossFit. Like, dude, it just like 30 minutes a day. That's all you need. Are you a Virgo? You have Virgo energy. I bet you're a Virgo. I'm a Gemini. I knew it. Typical thing for a Gemini to do is to pretend to be a Virgo. That's them with space.
Hmm. Well, right now, I feel like the outfit is just cosmetic and stat bonus versus doing something uh, impersonating a security officer. Good to know, though. Also, another good thing to know is I was looking up a YouTube video that was going into detail about each of the graphical options and the impact they have on your GPU. And surprisingly, NPC and crowd density didn't have that much of an impact on your GPU. Like a 2% difference, which is to say that honestly, there's no reason you shouldn't put CPU uh, citizen density on the max setting versus trying to put it on low to save space, which I'm happy about because it does make the world seem more alive. I couldn't imagine running this on low and just having an empty world walking around. It'd be like playing Wildstar four months after its release. Holy shit, what a reference agent. Not only because of the burn, but also because it was a space memo. I'm on fire tonight. I can't miss. Can you change it on console? I don't know, to be honest. I really don't. I have it on PC, so I can't speak to the console options. Basically. Okay. Thank you. Good night.